When I first moved to town, about seven o'clock, the town would close down. There would be nothing going on and we'd be playing volleyball in my backyard. But just by being the only light on in town, someone would show up at the house and say, hey, my friend's out there in the desert and he's stuck in the canyon and we need help. That immediately led me into contact with the sheriff's department. And I signed up as a volunteer. And I don't know if it's been 15 or 20 years, but uh, I still have the honor of going out to help folks when they need some help. A lot of the rescues that we see in Escalani are real innocent, simple mistakes. They've been over in Zion, had a great day when there was a ranger saying, go here and go there, and really helpful. And then they get to Escalani, and it's a 26-mile drive out to the trailhead there, and then they find themselves kind of wandering out on the sandstone and then across the sand. And the next thing they know, they realize it's getting a little hot, or it's getting a little late, and they're in trouble. A lot of rescues, most of them, somebody in the group recognized a problem, but didn't speak up. Mm. If you had only spoke up, all of you would have gone and had pizza instead. You spent the night <laughs> digging to the bottom of your backpack for some potato chips. It's gonna get pretty, here we go. They're simple things. We can all do these things. It's so easy. Just be ready. Just take it serious. Get to that trailhead on time. Have your lunch. Have your little first aid kit. And your water and your extra water. Plus your extra, extra water. And boy, will you feel great if you're out hiking and you find somebody hurt and you say, you know what? I got some extra, extra water. I got a phone number for the local search and rescue. I got it. Relax. We're cool. Nice to have some Too many beautiful people went out there to have a fun day and didn't come back. And it's not necessary. But we're making consequential choices every day. And uh, that means slowing it down, having a good time, being safe. <laughs>